Today, we're going to build a droid transport ship using 12 Lego pieces. These are all the pieces you are going to need. In the description of this video, I left the piece names, count, and design IDs. The core of our ship is going to be this one by two by two third brick with studs on two sides. And what we're going to do is to the top of it, we're going to get a one by one tile piece and just put it on that back stud here. It's kind of close to that small stud in front and just put it right there so it's nice and even. And then behind that tile piece, we're going to get a one by two plate, all right? And just put that plate so it's attached to that one stud here and goes over like that larger um, extension that doesn't have any studs like this. So we kind of created the top of our transport. Now on top of that two, one by two plate, we're gonna get some of these one by one slope pieces. And this is gonna be the piece we're using the most. But what we're doing is we're gonna put it on here on that back stud so that the tall end is up and it slopes down towards the back of our transport. And now we're gonna do the same thing on the front, that front stud, but this time it's gonna to go towards the front of our transport. Now underneath, now we're gonna to go to the bottom section here, that back stud, get another one of those cheese slopes, put it so that the thin end is on top and it slopes down towards the bottom. And we're gonna do that on both sides of that little cheese wedge slope with another cheese wedge slope. So again, thin part down to the thick. Do that again on the other side. And here we're gonna change things up. Now, Lego, they just put another one of these little cheese wedge slopes there, but to me, it, it made it look incomplete. So what I'm doing is I'm getting a one by two slope and you know, same positioning, but this time by doing that, it extends past that little kind of extension there and I think makes the model look a lot more complete. So by doing that on both sides, I feel like we have a more finished and complete look than what was in the Lego advent calendar. Now we've got that little stud exposed in the front there. What we're going to do is we're going to get a one by one plate piece and put it backwards so it sticks into that big hole there. And now to make that coned nose of the transport, we're going to get a one by one round plate and just put it right into our one by one plate we just put in. And here we have a droid transport ship ready to drop off a thousand battle droids or 30, whatever the actual capacity is, into the field of battle. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and you can click on the image to watch another video. Until next time, let's keep building together.